the beauty that just walked into our studio. Every gentleman is at attention right now. Look at them. Look at them. We don't know. They're so at ease. They're smiling with me. Jijo pale ya menini ya mejaribu kuskratch nini nini. Na kuambia. How are you though? I'm very well. How are you? I'm very good. You look amazing. Oh, thank you. I try. You look very lovely. I try. We haven't seen you around here on NTV since your show ended. Do you know I've been in this industry for like five years and Larry, you've never invited me on your show? Until now. Until now. Look at that. Mm. We saw you in Mali. Yeah. We were all very excited. We were like, oh, wow, she's very talented. Oh, really? Yes. Yeah, well, thank you. I, I <laughs> guess. I don't know. <laughs> thank you. Congratulations on all the great things you're doing. Asante. You're a mother. Yes, I How am. How old is your baby? She's one and a half. Oh, wow. I know time flies, right? Time really does fly. Yeah. You even have a mommy show now. I do have a mommy show. Can I plug that in? Yes, you can. So I have a mommy show. And it airs on Sundays <laughs> at 8 p.m. <laughs> PM. Fantastic on Ebru. Yes. On Ebru TV, I can say that on yes, NTV. You can. And it's a really good show for young moms who are new at this, like myself. Mm -hmm. So obviously, I'm not going to lecture anyone because I really don't. So you're learning to be a mommy alongside well. other mummies. Yeah, so we're learning together. So it's like uh, that. You know how it, it, it says uh, it takes a village to raise a child? Mm -hmm. That's like a village. How has motherhood changed you? In so many different ways. Um, I'm very much more patient now. You know, it's a child. You have to be patient mm -hmm, with them. Mm -hmm. um, it's changed how I, I look at things. I don't, know, I don't know how to explain it, but just by watching her, mm -hmm. it kind of makes me be a better version of myself. Because I see how she wakes up in the morning and she's happy already. So I'm like, why can't I be like that? Mm -hmm. I, I should wake yeah. up happy as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see how she's always busy running around. Why can't I be like that? I should be busy as well. I see mm -hmm. how she forgives so easily. You'll be like, I'm out, no. And she'll be upset. And then in, in two seconds, she'll be She's happy, happy again. again. So she teaches me very many things in very different ways that I really didn't see coming. Yeah. The, the, the period when you, you had the, the baby must have been really difficult for you because then you lost your mom. Oh, Larry, why do you have to go and ask me that? <laughs> yeah, but I'm glad for the time they had together. Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry yeah. about that. It's okay. It must have been really difficult. And that said, <clears throat> having a baby's... Yeah. I'm sorry, I didn't mean it's to. Okay. I didn't mean it's to. Okay. okay. So now you're busy. You're out there. You have a baby girl that you're taking yeah. care of. Yeah. You're, you've got a new movie coming out with uh, Nick Mutuma. With Nick Mutuma, yeah. What is this? It's, it's kind of a different concept. It's a very different concept. You know what happened was, I was watching... I can't remember exactly what movie I was watching. But then I thought to myself, we don't have... A romantic comedy in Kenya. Okay, there are plenty of movies that we don't have. Mm -hmm. But then that day just came to me, and then I tweeted it. I was like, you know what we need? We need a Kenyan romantic film. Mm -hmm. If we had one, who would you like to see star in it? So I wasn't like telling people, I want to do this. Mm -hmm. Should I or can I? And then mm -hmm. from that, all the responses I got, really a lot of them, mm -hmm. were mentioning Nick and I, Nick and I. So then I approached him with the idea. And um, I decided we should do it in a very different way. So it's a crowd-created film. Mm -hmm. So we got ideas from people. The scripts came in. Uh, we're going to hold online auditions. As in, everything happens as a crowd. I'm not taking over the film. It's a film that kind of belongs to everyone. Does that um, make sense? You're doing a film, but why are you shooting things on your phone? Like this video shows. Can we look at it? <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, Which play one? it. <laughs> ah, are I'm in love. love. Well, we will be with your help. So we're about to come up with Kenya's first romantic comedy and we need your help to do it. Mm -hmm. We're about to show you how in the next video. This is exactly what I mean because I didn't expect it to have the kind of response that it did. Mm -hmm. So when I tweeted it and then I approached him about it, I left with all these um, questions were coming in. So we just, we had to do it quickly. Mm -hmm. So we met up one day. This is our first meeting actually. Ever. We oh, wow. Not ever, but first meeting after my tweet went mm -hmm. out. Mm -hmm. And then we just took the... Nini, because people were really asking for it, so we just had to make it happen quickly. You look like you're really genuinely in love. Oh, we, I'm a really good actress, Larry. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh. So the chemistry is all acting. It is acting, yes. You put out an interesting update on, on the gram the other day, on Father's Day. Which one? We, we saw it. You said thank you to Giuliani for giving me the best gift ever, which is really sweet. Oh, he did give me. My baby is the best thing that has ever happened. I know moms say that all the time and it sounds so cliche, <laughs> but it's true. Mm -hmm. He did give me the best gift ever. Even though that relationship didn't work out, but you seem to have come out of it a good way. What? Oh. 
What are you talking about? Alama ya dukuduku. Alama ya dukuduku. You know, I think I think where this comes from right. is because we don't um, we don't post our relationship on social media. Can you? How do you have a relationship if you're not posting it on social media? But that's the the thing only people, pe the only way people date now is if you're uh, on, on the gram, media. on everybody's gram all the time, Let me declaring your undying love. <laughs> Let hmm? me answer this. Let me try and answer this like he would say it. Yes. You see how ukionezi buildings in Adyengwa. Mm -hmm. I can speak Swahili in this show. Yes, right? you can. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, right? These buildings in Adyengwa, right? Mm -hmm. Alafu wa zimefunikwa na magunia. Mm -hmm. Or this, this, I don't know what they call them. Tandarua. Zimefunikwa. So you mm -hmm. can really see what's happening inside. Yes. And what him and I have, we, we're a very young family. Yes. And I wouldn't want to subject us. To the scrutiny? Yeah, and I mean, Aita ungeza, ama kupunguza beya unga. I don't know. I'm very protective of things that I hold dear. Okay. Also, my baby hasn't been on social media. No pictures at all of the baby on social media. You can see the back of her head. You can see her feet. Why does your baby not have an Instagram account? How do we even know you have a baby? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I just, I wouldn't want to. I know that's a mini question. It's a thing that people do now. Yes. No. If I know, you have a celebrity I have spawn, that. it needs to have an Instagram I account. Spawn. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Celebrity <laughs> offspring. <laughs> I don't know. I wouldn't want to make such decisions for her. Maybe she'll grow up to to be one of those people who don't want to be on who social media. Private, yeah. So I don't want to make that decision for her. But that said, in your line of work, you need some degree of exposure, right? Yes. And then there's people who are doing social media and they're crazy and you're putting your entire life out there. Yeah. Do you worry about what you're putting out there and how much of it is too much? I do, I do worry, but I think it's in my system right now. I can't, even without uh, trying too hard, I mm -hmm. keep what I don't want on social media off social right. media. It's become second. When nature. you speak, the new Mombasa roots come out. Yeah. Where are you Mombasa? Nairobi. But But I came for university, mm -hmm. and then in university I was so broke, and then I decided to start to try and get into the entertainment industry and I did and it, it kind of worked Was out. that with Mali or was there something you were doing before that? I started with Changing Times. Oh yes, Changing Times on KTN. Yes. On KTN. Mm -hmm. And that was my launching pad. Whenever someone asks me this question, I always have to say I'll forever be grateful to Jennifer Gatero and mm -hmm. Philip Brayson because they gave me my first shot. And even it was supposed to be a really small role, mm -hmm. but then they ended up making it um, even better. I had a whole family around oh, me. Oh, fantastic. So the, I'll forever be grateful. But then, then you came on Mali on NTV and you just kind of blew up because that show was kind of massive yeah. and people were watching it and we ran it 3,000 times. Yeah, it was mm -hmm. East Africa's first uh, soap opera. Mm -hmm. So of course it was big. And then they gave me a role that I think um, uh, fit very well. And uh, it, uh, it was a very intense shooting schedule. We mm -hmm. shot every day except for Sundays. So it really was a chance for me to hone my craft. It was a job, like a full-time job. Yes. So every day I was acting. So that's, th that's how I got better at it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Beyond Mali, beyond all of those things, what are you doing now? Well, of course, there's my show. Mm -hmm. And of course, there's uh, the movie that we're trying to do with Nick Mutuma and Tosh Kitonga from Nairobi Half-Life. Oh, he's amazing. He is Best amazing. director in the business. Yes. So can you see now the fact that even he even was interested in my film? I was like, what? You know, it's a you, big Well, you like, I made deal. it. No, nah, I don't think I'll ever be like, I made it. <laughs> There's still so much to do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> still so much to do. But I want to really, um, I'm, I'm a really strong believer in you put out what you want. So I started saying how much I want to produce because mm -hmm. I really do want to produce. And now I have started producing. So I'm producing my Mommy 101 show in right. Ibru. I'm producing the, the film, film? With, with Nick as well. And there's so many other things that I also want to produce. Of course, I can't say them right now, but yes, they're coming. So yeah, watch out. Fantastic. Mm. Fantastic. You're a very busy woman. You're also a model. I tried that. I, I, don't, I, I don't know. I think I do better at acting. Mm -hmm. than, than modeling. Than modeling. No, I think based on those pictures, you do just fine in modeling as well. <laughs> I can economize those, lucky. those pictures are fire, my <laughs> friends. <laughs> <laughs> moto, moto, yeah. You can mm. to work it, but yeah, I do, I do do it occasionally, mm -hmm. and uh, I, I enjoy it. Yes, but my, my real love is acting. You're very listen. I want you to talk to this because we, 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 we get this a lot. A lot of young girls 
these days don't have positive role models. Uh -huh. The people they're following on social media, the kind of people that they see in their faces every day are not giving them the right direction. What do you tell young girls who look up to you? I'm going to tell them thank you for <laughs> thinking me worthy of being looked up to. And um, I would just, I would never want to instill like life values on someone. What I would say is to just always try to be a better, happier version of yourself. So wh whatever makes you happy, go ahead and do it. Okay. Before we go, I, I want to go to Kristen real quick. And Are see we if she's done? Got... Oh. Honey, you've been here 15 minutes. Really? Live television. It seems like it's been two. Like that. Okay. Chub, chub. Where is Christine? Kristen is on the other side. We've hidden her in a room oh. there. Yeah, I'm where here. She, she's got all the Twitter people <laughs> speaking directly to her. Oh, goodness, Twitter people. You people scare me. <laughs> Um, you shouldn't be scared. All positive comments. Uh -huh. <laughs> Michael yes. Congo, um, this could be, the, uh, he says, uh -huh. he messaged if you could show Brenda. Why you yeah, you this could be us, oh, wait. but you didn't reply my DM. I will, uh, <laughs> I will reply to that DM. It's been like two weeks since I had Mutura. I'm having the draw. <laughs> that Mutura looks good. It looks so good. Pili Pili to Apokando Nemikos. Aposawa. <laughs> what else is there? Yeah, uh, Patrick Mwinde says, it's been long since Brenda Warimo graced our screens. Glad that she's doing something. Missed her on the screen. Oh, thank Fantastic. you so much. All right. And then uh, Dylan wants to know, what else does Brenda do apart from acting? I think she's, she's answered acting. that, right? Yeah. The producing. She's and producing. She's, the mummy. She's mummying. She's <laughs> busy. Busy, busy, busy. <laughs> okay, that's yes. it? Yeah, that's it for now. Awesomeness. Awesomeness. Look. Positive comments on the yeah, internet. Yeah, I know. Woo. Look, internet, give yourselves a cookie. You can be good. <laughs> Thank you, man. Mm -hmm. oh. Yo. <laughs> Welcome, Ogopa. You can be tense, kidog. You know, it's so, I love it when you speak Swahili. Why don't you oh. speak Swahili? Just speak more Swahili and I'll just listen. What do you want me to say? Chachote <laughs> too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, I'm going to say, I'm going to I'm going to the trend. The trend. <laughs> It's a problem, man. Atuwezi right? tukakufanya upande basi. Ay, basi tuende. Lini hati? Uh, Tarahi 22. <laughs> Why is she laughing at me? Because <laughs> you know I'm seeing your... I'm seeing those you gears guys, turning, you guys, my brain is working know. Yeah, before you overdrive. Hey, Arnold, you should be whispering things into my ear. My director, Arnold, is from Kosto. He knows this oh. Swahili thing. Ah. I mean, I tell you, he struggles up with it. And I'm going to say, 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 I'm Thank you very much. Unless for you want to say anything, life. listen, we could be here all night. If you want to say more things, just say them now. No, I don't want to say anything else. I, I've had a good run. Let me finish with that. Yes, and on a high. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. So I'll watch my show mm? on this Sunday. Okay. <laughs> I, yeah, on Ebru. I invoice to advertise the shows. I asked you before. You said I could. On Ebru, 8 p.m. Thank you. I am Miss Kiza. She's learning to be a mommy. She's acting. She's producing. We love her. She's fantastic. She's pretty. She's talented, all of those things. What more could you, you ask for?